So it's true. You were one of Ram's prisoners? Come to finish me off, Ebony. I gotta admit, you're a hard woman to keep down, Amber. I can't even play a little computer game without you showing up trying to spoil my fun. For your information, that was no game. Then why did you attack me? Because I had to. Amber? Are you okay? Mm. What's wrong with her? Nothing. I'm fine, really. What's this about a computer game? Are you involved with these technos, Ebony? Using people as pawns in some game? Because if you are, Look, I... I don't know anything. Ram took me into his virtual playroom and showed me some stuff. Before I knew it, we were being attacked. She was there, trying to waste me. All I did was defend myself. Go ahead. Ask her. Amber? When you're in the game, it's get or be got. If you get hit, you lose a life. But if you score a hit, you get one back. Like in the arcades. And you expect me to believe you're not involved in this? I don't care what you think. Ram is giving me a hard enough time without all this. If he finds out you guys broke into his lab... He is not going to find out, though. Unless, of course, you've sold out to the Technos, Ebony, and I can't imagine you'd do such a thing. Well, Ebony has been doing deals on our behalf. Mostly. Look, I'm out there every day protecting all of you. How long do you think the Morats would have lasted against the Technos without me? Well, now you have a perfect opportunity to prove your loyalty. How about it, Ebony? You gonna turn us in? Wait and see. Ebony! Let her go. Look, m maybe we should find somewhere else to live. You're not going anywhere. Except back to bed. Amber, you're in no condition. Let us worry about Ebony. I can't stay long. Okay, babe, you look terrible. What's wrong? I can't handle this. Uh, look, if, if you're upset because I missed our date... No, it's not that. It's Java Lex. Is that all? Are you kidding? What if she tells Ram about us? What if she does? What are you, his property or something? Yes, actually. Look, I think we should, you know, cool it for a while. What? Because of Java? She's your sister. She's not going to rat on you. You don't know her like I do. Uh, come and sit down. No, Lex. I'm scared. But nothing's going to happen, I, I promise. So come and sit down and we'll talk this through, okay? Now, you know what this is really about, don't you? What? She's jealous. Of me? Of us. Of what we've got. She's jealous of this. Don't, Lex. And this? <laughs> and this? <laughs> Let me guess. You tried insults, but that didn't work. Now you're gonna beg for your life. Am I getting warm? Not my life. Amber's. You have no idea what she's been through. What? You mean losing Bray? No, I can't imagine what that feels like. Come on, Ebony. You can't support these monsters. What they're doing to people. I don't support anybody but myself, okay? And that is what I'm afraid of. What happened to you two anyway? Why didn't you get out while you had the chance? We stayed with the Ecos for a while. What's left of them. 
And I promise, Ebony, that as soon as Amber's strong enough, we're gonna go back. Our, our babies are there. I just want you to know that whatever you might think of me or Amber, we are no threat to the Technos. Or to you. How many fingers am I holding up? Four. Good. You're still a bit shaken up, though, but after a bit of rest, you should be all right. Thanks. Chloe! Are you going out? What does it look like? I'm sorry to keep nagging, but you could at least tell us where you're going. Why? In case you get in any trouble. What possible trouble could I get into? You going out with Ved? I can take care of myself. <sighs> What's wrong with her? Nothing, apparently. Hmm. How's Amber? She's okay. Is she up for talking? Why? Oh, no reason. Looks like you got your hands full. <laughs> so, which is better? Reality space? Or the real thing? I think we both know the answer to that. Why else would I be here? Huh? You could be spying on me. Oh, yeah? Like you Morats are such a big threat to the Technos. Get real, Lex. Could be. There's all sorts of things going on that you don't know about. Actually, that's the reason I couldn't make it yesterday. What kind of stuff? Come back to bed and I might tell you. Get real. <sighs> I'm spending way too much time here. Java's warned me already. If it gets back to Ram... She's not gonna say anything. How do you know? She gave me the same line. And nothing's happened yet, has it? She spoke to you? She was here yesterday. You mean she knows about this place? So what? Why didn't you tell me? What are you getting so excited about? I need my head examined. Siva! Remember the Locos? I always used to think... At least it can't get any worse than this. But you know what? Zoot was a pussycat. Hey, try not to think about it. Amber, you okay? Oh, we thought we'd lost you there for a while. I feel like I lost myself. Amber, is there anything you can tell me about this technology? How it works? Uh, not much. You're looking at a screen. But it wraps around, so you can't turn away. You can close your eyes, but when you open them, sometimes it's, it's pretty and sometimes it's scary. You can walk or run wherever you want, but the trouble is, so can they. They? The enemy. Springing out at you from behind every doorway and every tree. They just keep coming at you over and over again, trying to get you and there's nowhere to run, and it just goes on and on and on. You wanted to see me? Did you get my gift? Chocolates. Very nice. I chose the hard centers. Was that right? How did you guess? And, uh, how are those flowers doing? We said that once they wilted... I'd give you my answer, I know. But they're still going strong. They're beautiful. And so are you. But I still want my answer. Isn't there a small problem with your idea, Ram? Having my sisters and I for your wives? I mean, we don't get on. You've seen it for yourself. Whenever we're together... Don't be avert, Ebony. This feud with your sisters, I can make it disappear like that. I will give you more time, not too much more. Do we understand each other? Everything okay? It is now you're here. Let's go somewhere. Let's just get out of here. What is it? What was Ram talking about? 
Oh, uh, computers, the usual stuff. That guy gives me the creeps. <laughs> Try working for him. Did you find out any more about the raid? I know where it happened. That's about all. Jay, do you trust me? Right now, you're the only one I trust. I know who did it. The raid? It was the mall rats. They sprung some kids. One of them was Amber. I told you about her. She's a big shot in the city. She would have been there later, but... Don't tell me. You had other plans? It wasn't like that. Why are you telling me this, Ebony? I don't like the way he treats you. You're a general, but he's freezing you out. Whereas if it turns out you're the only one who knows what's going on... If only that were true. I'm going to check the facts first. Starting with this software lab. Well, how are you going to get through their security? By ordering them to let me in. Like you said, I'm a general. Want to come? Didn't they ever take this helmet thing off? Only for sleeping and eating. They were testing our endurance. Um, Seems we got to you just in time. You know the worst part? <laughs> the game it gets inside your head. But after a while, you can't even sleep. <laughs> you close your eyes and you're right back. This one time, I, I thought I saw Bray. I called out to him, and he, he just looked straight through me and turned and walked away. I tried to follow him, but I, I lost him. You've been with him. Why do you say that? Don't lie to me, Siva. I wanted to tell you. I did see Lex today, but it was only to say goodbye. You broke it off with him. Really? Really. Good. Now you're being sensible. I did what you asked, and I don't want to hear it anymore. What do you mean I can't go in? You don't tell me where I can and can't go. I'm sorry, sir. Ram's orders. I have the authorization. Yeah? How's this for authorization? Step away, soldier. I don't want you to get hurt. Jay! What's up? I'll take over from here. Come on in. After what you said, I thought I'd check this place out for myself. I thought Graham was exaggerating. You know how he is? But then I soon discovered how much fun these guys were having. I mean, if that's not happiness, then I don't know what is. Yeah, it looks that way. I've been asking around lately. It seems to me that those guys that got busted out didn't even want to go. Is that so? Absolutely. I mean, who'd want to leave this? And their leaders? The guys who busted them out? They had to beg them to leave. I mean, they were having so much fun here. Well, Jay, I said you were being paranoid. Hey, it could happen to anyone. It's like I said, Ram overreacted. But these guys are just queuing up to try out this stuff. You want me to hook you up for a spin? Thanks, Ben. Maybe another time. No problem. Fuck it off. Gone. <laughs> Why did you let him get away with that? He treated you like a fool. We have no proof that Ed was lying. What? You know as well as I do he was scamming you. I said we have no proof. Everything I say to Ved goes directly back to Ram. I have to be careful now. Things are different, Ebony. I didn't realize that Ved was that deeply involved with Ram. Neither did I. Not until today. You know, I never saw it coming. All this time I've been living with a genius and I didn't even know it. 
putting up with these people, playing their stupid games all the time, that makes you the genius in my books. You're late. Something I had to take care of. So it's the story, Chloe. Your place or mine? Neither. I told you to give yourself to sector six, and you still went to sector four. What's wrong with you? Legs. Before you say anything, I'm here on business. Yeah, like what? Uh, the power? Yeah, the electricity. What about it? Well, I, I heard you were doing it in rounds, sector by sector. Yes, we are, and what's that got to do with you? As the sheriff, quite a lot, actually. I've got to let my people know so they don't fry themselves. Have you had a look out there lately, Java? It's like Armageddon. Okay. You want to speak to the chief engineer? Go to the lobby and ask them. That's what I was trying to do. Yeah. I can't live without you, babe. I was getting lonely, so I thought, you know, we could... Oh, no, you don't. Java. I've talked to Java. She's cool. She thinks I'm here in business. That's your idea of cool? Lex, please. You can't do this. Not here. Ram could come in any minute. What are you going to tell him if he finds you? Business. Please leave. Now. <sighs> okay. I'm leaving. Just one kiss. One proper kiss. You promise? Vert's on it. Just a minute. Yes, what do you want? I'm in the middle of something. I just... I... Nothing. Sorry. Doesn't matter. What did you think? Huh? Was it okay? Was what okay? Oh yeah. Guess so. Is that all he had to say about it? Guess so. Hi. How did you get in here? I know my way in. I came to see Amber. There's no one here but... Please. I have no weapon. I'm alone. Do you honestly think I would come here like this if I wanted to arrest her? I just want to speak to her. So why do they call you Mouse? Well, I think it's pretty. It suits you. Amber, there's someone to see you. This is Jay. He's one of the technos. How did it go? The business with your brother. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, he bought it. But you're not happy, Ved. You're thinking that perhaps I've pushed too far, I overstepped the mark. No, no, not at all. I don't mind doing it. I mean, I wouldn't jay off my back as much as you did. He's a good man, your brother, an honest man. But he doesn't see the larger picture as we do, does he, Ved? He's forever stuck in this world while you and I roam the universe. <laughs> We've been robbed. What? Computers. 
Half a dozen of them taken from the store sometime today. How could this happen? Where was security? I mean, first the lab and now this? What is going on around here? Oh. I know I'm being sold a lie. And just looking at you, I can tell that... What do you want? Just... deceive myself. And then what? I don't know. Well, maybe you should go. No. I want to hear this. I want to know if he thinks it was all worth it. Laying waste to an entire city, taking our friends, and just for a bunch of torturers who won't even tell their generals what's going on? I tried to bring about a new society. I tried my best. Yeah, well, your best wasn't good enough. It wasn't nearly good enough. I'm off the road? No. You're the other life in Seoul tonight? Yeah. Sorry. Anything on your mind? You don't want to know. Well, I'm going back to the mall. You coming? Uh, you know, I think I'm just going to take a bit of a walk and clear my head. Suit yourself. Good night. Night, Dean. We can trust you. You don't. Well then, why should I let you leave? I told certain people I came here. I haven't completely lost it, Pride. You say that Amber was the leader of this tribe once. Not just this one. I can see why. Well, I better go. Hey, Chloe. Did you have a nice time? Not bad. Siva? Java? Nice one. Thinking of going digital. What is this? Well, it's really quite simple. That's stolen property. And we're here to take it back. Wait a minute. I don't know anything about that. Well, don't worry. You can tell Ram all about it. I should warn you, though, he's in a pretty bad mood. Get out of here. Don't worry. We're leaving. And you're coming, too. I hope you know a good lawyer, Lex. You're under arrest. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>